Hold on, stop. You accessorize with a sloth? I accessorize with a sloth. This is Belt. <laughs> Mine's Sash. Ooh la la. Hi, I'm Max Lawson, a storyboard artist at DreamWorks Animation, and today I'm excited to show you how to draw Sash, a character from our new movie, The Croods, A New Age. Let's get started. Okay, so to start drawing Sash, I just start with her face. You know, I think what would appeal to me most about living in prehistoric times, like the Croods, is just the nature. I mean, everywhere you go, it's like a really exciting hike. It's just something new and amazing to see, somewhere to go, or the ability to make your home wherever you are. And I, I don't think that I'd be able to hack it in prehistoric times. I kind of like having my air conditioning and refrigerator and computer and phone and video games and, and all that. And then for her body, really all it is is just an upside down triangle. And for her arms, they're just these long spindly so uh, sloth arms. So draw them as long as you want. I say, and then they kind of get thick down near the bottom. And she's got these three big toes at the bottom there. For her other arm, we're gonna have it going up like she's hanging off of a branch. So in the same way that Guy has belt, Dawn has sash. She wears around her all the time as this kind of like best friend slash fashion statement. We'll add fingers wrapping around the branch. There we go. Maybe just add a little detail to the branch for fun. And for her legs, uh, they're kind of like her arms, but just like smaller and squishier. So her toes just look kind of like these these like long beans um, just sticking out of her the stump of her arm there. All right, and now we just have to draw the fur. Sasha's hair looks kind of like a like a big mop almost. Uh, just this big messy pointy mop of, of hair. Uh, just this absolutely wild shape. Uh, and then she's also got a patch of fur up on her chest. And same thing, just a bunch of wavy triangles. All right, and now we'll color her in. Uh, let's use a kind of a hot pink for her main fur. We're going to be coloring in everything except for her face and the tuft of hair on her chest. My favorite thing about drawing Sash is really her arms because she doesn't really have elbows or anything. She just has these big noodle arms that you can kind of draw every which way and uh, you just have a lot of fun with it. And her hair is just crazy and wild. So Sash is Dawn's kind of loyal sidekick. She's very playful, very sweet. You know, like Dawn, I think, kind of dreams of adventure and fun. Me personally, I love sloths. Uh, they're, they have these cute faces. They love to just hang around. They move really slow and so do I. So, you know, we've got that going for us. Now for her face and her hair, I'm just gonna use a uh, kind of a light pink crayon. You know, for me, I think my sash it would be my three-year-old daughter. She's got kind of a similar personality and she does like to just wrap herself around me and hang off of me like a sash. And there you go. You've got your very own sash. Ooh la la. Thank you for drawing sash with me today. And you can see more of sash in her new movie, The Croods, A New Age. Keep drawing. What's that? It's just a scar. Every mark is an adventure. And my dad doesn't even know about this one. Whoa, peanut toe. <laughs>